as you can see, it's raining here. It's uh, 9 a.m. on Saturday morning, day one of the Pan Mass Challenge. And I think I'll be riding indoors today. Fortunately, that was the plan. Um, today's kind of going to be a washout by the looks. I'll probably do the shorter ride today. And then uh, do the longer ride tomorrow outdoors, hopefully. We'll see how it goes. So here we are, it's 10 a.m. I've just started my Saturday ride indoors on Zwift. We'll see how things go, it's gonna be a sweaty day. Okay, I just finished 130k on the indoor trainer, and man, am I white. Uh, incredibly humid, hot, sweaty, just a really brutal ride. Um, sitting outdoors now, it's really humid out and hot outside, but uh, it looks like it has been raining, so probably riding indoors was a good idea, but <laughs> boy, did that hurt. That was not fun. Um, hopefully tomorrow, uh, the weather will allow me to ride outside, do a full century outside uh, to complete my Pan Mass Challenge mileage, uh, aiming for 300k. But uh, right now it's time to shower, nice cold shower, nice cold drink, uh, fuel up and rest up um, and recharge all my batteries for a really long hard ride tomorrow. And hopefully I'll be able to do it without rain although I'm not very hopeful of that, but we'll see. But that's a wrap on day one. At least uh, the first day was completed successfully, if painfully. <laughs> okay, it's 6.20 on Sunday morning. Uh, welcome to day two of my Pan Mass Challenge. As you can see, I'm outside. I'm about 10 kilometers into my ride. Um, and behind me is the Monongahela River and what passes for sunrise here in Pittsburgh. Um, pretty overcast. Um, it did rain overnight. The roads are damp, but not sopping. Um, and I'm really hoping for a dry ride today, hopefully, we'll see. Um, by starting at 6 a.m., I'm hoping to um, have, uh, hoping to get home before any diurnal showers spring up and thunderstorms, so we'll see. That's what the forecast says. Um, other than that, um, things are looking okay. I feel all right. Of course, that's not gonna last for 170 kilometers. Um, it wouldn't last 170 kilometers on a fully rested day, never mind a day where I did 130 kilometers the day before. So we'll see how that goes. Um, obviously looking for a challenging day today, but, uh, so that's it for this morning. Let's get out on the road.
Okay, as you can see, I'm back. Um, still alive after 170 kilometers or 300 kilometers over two days. Um, PMC done. My 17th PMC, my third remote one. This one half virtual and half IRL. Um, today's Century Plus was the IRL portion. Uh, did get wet, um, but not too bad. Um, mostly it was damp, but not actually rainy, um, with just an occasional bit of sun. So pretty happy with how it turned out. Pretty pleased, pretty wiped out. Really looking forward to a shower because I am filthy um, from all the rain and road grime and so forth. Um, but otherwise happy. Um, and of course, absolutely wanna thank all of my sponsors um, because without you guys, I couldn't do this ride. Um, and it means a hell of a lot to me, um, both the cause and obviously the, the riding I enjoy. Mostly. <laughs> but mostly it's for the cause, and um, it's something I've been involved with since 2001, and I couldn't do it if I wasn't confident that I could make the fundraising minimum. So thank you so much for your support and for your help and for making my ride possible, and of course for advancing the state of cancer research and treatment.